Hey, what up? Today, guys, I'm gonna make a very easy dessert and great for summertime. <laughs> well, it's going to be a nectarine tapioca pudding. I'm gonna use tapioca pearls. Tapioca, it's a starch that comes from the cassava roots, very popular in Brazil, Europe, and also here in America. What I'm gonna do, I'm going to soak my tapioca in cold water for 30 minutes. By the time my tapioca is blooming, I am going to take care of my nectarine marmalade. And then you're gonna cut this into small dice. So I'm going to heat up my uh, non-stick frying pan. Then I am going to cook my diced nectarine until it softens and then I'm going to add some honey. One more minute. That's it. Nectarine marmalade, done. So the tapioca has absorbed the moisture. So what I am going to do right now, I am going to transfer my tapioca in my frying pan, add my coconut milk. So I am going to bring this to a boil, stirring every so often and cook it for two minutes. The good news is that it's dairy free and sugar free somehow. The only sugar you add is gonna be a good one, an organic, raw, unfiltered honey. So that's good for you. And for the bees too. We too often take things for granted. And the beauty of the nature is something that we should preserve. So have you noticed that there's no sugar in the tapioca? Why? Because it's going to be served with a lemon verbena infusion. Next, I am going to make a gavotte. It's a paper thin dry crepe, if you wish. This is going to enhance the dessert for sure. So first, I'm going to bring to a boil water, oil and salt. Meanwhile, I'm going to mix egg whites, honey, two tablespoons, lemon zest, flour and the boiling water, oil and salt. So I am going to let this cool at room temperature and refrigerate it for about an hour. It can be done actually a day ahead as well. Spread gavotte mixture on silicone mat or greased parchment paper and bake until brown for about 20 minutes. For plating now, I would begin with a layer of nectarine marmalade, then tapioca pudding, nectarine wedges, broken pieces of crispy gavotte, some greens such as mint leaf, and of course, a drizzle of lemon verbena infusion. About that. Hoping guys that you have truly enjoyed this easy and refreshing summer dessert. To get the full recipe, well, go to brunoskitchen.net. Please like me on Facebook and follow me on Instagram at Bruno Albuz in one word. And don't forget to subscribe. It's amazing.